What's up, YouTube family? I'm back. Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Sam. Sam's back. We're back with Baby Metal for the first time on the channel. Baby Metal. You guys have said this a couple of times in the comments, and we've now arrived. It's taken us 750 videos, but we finally <laughs> arrived at Baby Metal. And this is the first time that I am ever hearing about Baby Metal. Yeah, I mean, um, other than the comments, we have no idea yeah. what to expect with this one. You guys were just saying on some of the other heavy metal stuff that we've been doing that this is a group that we should check out. I think also it's been suggested on groups like Bandmade. Um, okay. So I, th I think maybe that's why, you know, there's some relevance to them being that baby metal is a Japanese band. Yeah. And they do like, I'm assuming metal music yes. based off the name. <laughs> yes. So, um, we're doing gimme chocolate here. Uh, interesting two song title. exclamation parts. Yeah. Interesting song title. I'm not sure if this is going to be a mix of English and Japanese lyrics, all Japanese, because it looks like in the title here, it says first, I think that's gimme chocolate in Japanese, right? Mm. So interesting, the symbols that all, just those those symbols can equate to gimme chocolate. I know, crazy. That's pretty wild. I think it's like more of like sounds, isn't it? Hmm? What? Like I thought Japanese, like sometimes the reason why it's condensed is I have is no it's idea. Like sounds? I don't, I don't I have know. no, I just think it's cool that there's yeah. that few symbols that- Crazy. That, but you're probably right. Anyways, you guys can let us know in those comments. Yes. We don't know anything about this. We don't know anything about baby metal. We're going in blind. We're jumping into this one because we like to learn. And we've learned a whole lot about many different groups, including Bandmade being one of them on this journey. So if you want to join us on this journey, yeah. you can hit that subscription button and the notification bell. We drop two videos every single day. We drop lots of different kinds of content. What do we got, Samantha? We got comedy, sports, music, history, lots of different types of music. Yeah, and we've been doing it for about a year and we're gonna plan to continue going forward. So we'd love to have you as a part of that. If you want to join and jump on with us, you're more than welcome to. All right, is there anything else you guys want to add before we get started? I don't think so. I'm ready to do it. All right, let's find out what baby metal is. Let's do it. off the bat. What is going on right now? What is going on right now? This is such a strange mix. We've got these these young ladies. They which look like they're like 14. Hold that thought because we're going to pause and check out how old they are. Okay, so apparently they're 15 years old or somewhere around there. Yeah, like two of them are 15, one of them 17, so like teenagers. Assuming that we've got that correct. Yes. But wild because I was thinking to myself though, I'm like... They look really young. Yeah. But you never know because I would say Japanese people have good genetics for yes. their they youthfulness. Tend to look young. Yes. And um, so that's one thing that's pretty wild that they're this young and they're composing something like this. But we're not seeing them play any, any of the instruments, right? No, it's the vocals. So I, I don't know if they played it, but they just didn't perform it that way. And they yeah. just wanted to focus on what they're doing with the choreography yeah. because they're also dancing in this one. Yeah. Or if they have a band and then they just do the vocals and the choreography. Right. That's also another possibility. But you guys can let, let us know and elaborate in those comments. Yeah. And clearly this is much different than we experience yeah. regularly. Um, it's very heavy, but then like they started off right away. They got into a super heavy, but then obviously the, I assume it's probably going to be the chorus section. It sounds very like punk rock ish and like a higher, you know, when they come on their vocals and they start like singing more. Yeah. Um, to me, that sounds more pop than punk rock. Well, yeah. Pop punk rock, maybe a combination yeah, of all those things. But, yeah. uh, 
like this, I said, like I think it's also because they're so young, right? But these yeah. are very like high pitched, like young girl kind yeah. of vocals, and I'm like, this I is guess that's a weird the blend, baby metal <laughs> yeah. aspect, right? They're babies basically, <laughs> and making metal music. They're still doing metal, anyways. Let's find out what else they're gonna do here. I was just so blown away yeah, by what we were seeing. So different, and uh, they got the the outfits too that remind us a little bit of Bandmate, I would say, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, a little bit. I mean, yeah, I guess. You they, know, the large skirt. Component yeah, yeah. And, and um, this is all in Japanese, right? Yeah. Yeah, so I thought. This is so wild. I have never seen anything like this in my life from a music standpoint. That is for sure. I mean, kudos to them, these young girls doing their thing from a completely different genre standpoint, like the mix of what sounds like a thrash metal riff with this very, as you alluded to, pop vocal feel, obviously having a ton of fun with the choreography as well. And, you know, um, being young girls with it, which is, you know, fun to see and like i said kudos to them for for doing their thing and and trying to be trendsetters and and yeah clearly they're super super popular because they've been so different in what they're providing right and i i would say for me personally like this isn't something i'm probably going to go out and listen to regularly <laughs> yeah. but i'm you know like i said mostly just impressed with you know how well they've done at such a young age in oh, making yeah. something so unique. Well, it's so crazy to me because like, obviously, you know, if they're out here doing these concerts at this point, at this age, they're already relatively popular. Oh yeah. Like the crowd's show. going nuts. So that's what I'm saying. Like they obviously had to start younger than this. So to be like, like if they're 15 here, it's like, yeah. how young were you when you decided you wanted to start a heavy metal band? Yeah. Right. Like that's crazy to me. Yeah. Um, so again, kudos to them. The closest thing I can say that this reminds me of, and it's not even the same thing, but just like the closest thing is, I cannot remember for the life of me the name of it, but the band that we did where they do heavy metal and then it switches into being more electric dance music and then it goes back to being heavy oh, metal. Oh, electric cowboy? Yes. So like it's not the same thing, but it's like the right. two opposite ends of the spectrum where that's it's like true. super true. heavy and then all of a sudden this like light, poppy, dancey kind of vibes, yeah. which is like kind of what this is like. Yeah, that's very valid. I think that's a good uh, good assessment between you know two completely different all groups one's a, a all male group the yes. other one's all female yeah. one's from a different area of the world i, I can't remember i think they're from germany electric call boy, somewhere so. european yeah. yeah but that i think would say you're right that they are similar in the respect that they go from this heavy sound yes. to more of the this pop light vibe. Like, la, la, la. yeah yeah and i think they're interesting though with it too because i think they're young obviously they're cute in that they have this innocent 
look about them. And so then they have this heavy sound alongside that innocent look yeah. of their image but the thing that's crazy is that like they're i feel like they are very like cute and smiley but then they're wearing this like leather yeah. like dark because like, you mentioned that they look like bandmade in their outfits right which they they kind of do but it's like to me this is like way darker and more like, like they're wearing like leather and like lace up things and like, yeah you know what i mean which is like for such young girls i feel like it's yes. also like the opposite of innocent right? yes so. that's very very true um i think maybe that's as we alluded to kind of offsetting on all ends of the mm-hmm. spectrum just so, lots of contradictory things going on yeah here. so um i can see why you guys were saying yeah, that we have to check, the, check sure. this out because it's nothing that we've ever experienced no, it's cool before. for sure to, to, to see yeah and it's uh, like you were alluding to clearly the fans are going nuts yeah. and they're having the time of their life up there so and they're like little you know, choreographed routines yeah kudos to them um you know, I'd like to still know who's playing the instruments, so that would be yeah, uh, because yeah. there is somebody playing the drums there, it's right? So kind of creepy mask on, huh? With this kind of creepy <laughs> mask on. Yes, that's the darker component again, right? Yeah. <laughs> See you in the mosh pit. Oh, so that was Baby Metal, Gimme Chocolate. I'm also going to have to look up to see what those lyrics mean because I want to know what they're talking about with chocolate. Well, what I was thinking about was that they were so happy for chocolate. And they're like... <laughs> <laughs> Give me chocolate. I love chocolate. That's why I'm smiling so much during my performance and I'm so happy. Yeah, I'm also kind of curious because they were doing something with their belly and like, <laughs> I don't know. So I want to know what they're saying. Clearly, they put some thought into the choreography yeah. as well. And um, Chocolate makes my belly happy. <laughs> there you go. Seems like Sam's a big fan of baby metal. So um, any closing thoughts you want to add before we go? Not really. I just thought it was a really cool experience. Like, like you said, probably not my cup of tea to be listening to on like all the time just because it's not really like the style of music I would normally listen to but I thought that was really creative and like really unique and really cool yeah kudos to them for doing their thing thank you for that suggestion guys we appreciate you getting us to check it out if you want to hit that like button for us now if you enjoyed our reaction please do so it helps with our algorithm and it'll help you with baby metal and getting that content to you and make sure you leave us a content a content comment as well letting us know your thoughts any insights you can provide on this song such as the lyrics the band all that that we mentioned during our video yeah and uh, if you like music you can expect that on this channel if you like sports if you like comedy if you like history you can also expect that on this channel yep. so if you want to check out more of our content we'd love to have you around hit the subscribe button don't forget the notification bell as well because youtube sometimes forgets to let people know yeah. when we drop our content you don't want to miss out that's right so hopefully you want to join us on this journey build the community that we've got going and we'll see you tomorrow see you in the next one <laughs>